Hey everyone, this is Scott from Express, and today we're going to learn how to convert your posts into your WB1 slider. So here I have my post as a slider. So to do this, we'll go to our backend and add a new slider. So I'm just going to call this a post slider. So this is going to be a post type. So I'm just going to click on post slide. So you can see that my settings have adapted according to the post slider uh, type. So I'm just going to add a post slide. And here you have a description link. And uh, you can choose either a post category or your custom post types so post types and you can select a category or post slash custom type and you can select your custom post type here I have post and pages only but if you have a custom post type it should list over here so I have a category over here W1 slider and here are my posts from that category so I'm just going to select them all so these are your normal posts of from WordPress so I'm just going to add this post slides and you can see my slides have been created so if I check here I have my post title post description you can edit them if you like from here alone my post image and you can uh, click to show new buttons and add button text let's say read more and you can link this button to a post link or you can add a custom link if you want and put your link over here I'm just going to select post link for now and you can uh, choose to show the date and number of counts if you like and you have the settings for all your slides I'm not going to configure any of them to show you the difference between the two so you have another slide so once I have done this, uh, I have a single slide layout or a carousel view. I'm just going to choose carousel view. And you can see that my settings have adapted according to the carousel slide. So I'm just going to choose one of the navigation arrows. Let's set this one. I like this one. So for the carousel settings, if we open, we will see you can define the slide width, slide height, uh, count of slides and the slide margin for your carousel slider. Also uh, we have your post or image carousel slide settings and here you can choose the carousel type. We have uh, six different types from one, uh, this being two so you can choose any type you like uh, I'm just going to go with number I think number two so once I've said this you can also you also have the option to change the font size and the font colors for your title description and your button and you can control your auto control settings if you like So I'll just publish this. So once it's published, I'm just going to go down and copy the short code. Create a new page and paste the short code over there. So I'm just going to call this uh, post slider. Paste my short code and publish. So I'm going to view my front end and here we have our post slider with your image, description and title. And you can see the difference uh, between the ones with the read more button and the comment count and the date and the one without. So you can choose to show them or not show them. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned for more videos on WB1 Slider Pro. Thank you.